Today we're going to show you how to perform a residual current device, RCD, trip test using our KPS MultiCheck 6010 multifunction tester. It's as simple as turning on the device, which is designed for efficient operation, then proceeding to carefully select the RCD trip test function from the available options. Following this, you will need to choose the appropriate time setting for the test. In this particular instance, we'll set it to automatic, allowing the device to determine the optimal parameters. We'll simply plug it into our standard electrical power source outlet. It will display all the essential information that we need to know. Voltages, the exact current level at which the RCD device should reliably trip, and also the specific type of RCD itself. Once we have gathered all the information, the device will display a clear green triangle, which we will use to proceed with the testing process. And it's as simple and straightforward as pressing the test button and then initiating the actual test procedure. It trips at the nominal value. We reset, then reset again five times the nominal value. We reset once more and at half the nominal value. In this case, it will not trip. With the ramp function, it will trip. We will now proceed to reset the system once again, and once this test is successfully finished, it will then provide us with a clear confirmation indicating that the RCD is fully operational and functioning correctly, as simple as that.